Hi guys, welcome back to Sharman's Kitchen. It is a fun day preparing some delicious uh, food for my son for his birthday. I am trying to get all the dishes that he requested. So the next thing I'm gonna be making for him, and this is no surprise, he asked for duck curry and dal and rice. So he have his Guyanese roots in there so now I'm going to be preparing my duck curry and dal and rice. If you guys want to see this part of it, come on down and let's get cooking some braille duck curry now for the board day boy. Guys, look at my dal. Dal is ready. I just have to finish with the duck now. And my dinner for the board day boy will be completed. So the next dish that I'm working on is the duck curry for dinner. And I have here some broad leaf thyme, one onion. I have some fine leaf thyme, some garlic, some maruru pepper, and some green onion. I'm gonna blend everything else on the board except the onion. And I'll come back and show you guys how I put the duck curry together. So in this bowl here, I have my spices for the dog curry. Right here, I have some garam masala. I'm gonna leave all the measurements in the description below. Over here, I have some duck and goat curry powder. Over here, I have some roasted ground jeera or cumin. Here, I have some turmeric powder. And over here, I have my lawless curry powder. Now we're gonna add all our grind seasoning that we um that i just grind up into the bowl and we're gonna make a nice paste and this is what we're gonna use to chunk it up it smells so good that flavor from the maruri i can tell right away this is gonna be a good duck curry so here i have my curry paste looking all good and nice i roughly blend the ingredients because I still want that chunkiness of the spices and the herbs to be in the meat while I'm cooking it. So now I'm going to add it to my pot. I'm using my pressure pot to cook the duck because I like when the meat is nice and soft. If you don't like using a pressure pot, you can also cook this in a regular pot but just cook it a little bit extra. For me, this is gonna take me like 30 minutes and the duck will be nice and soft. I'm gonna cook the spices and the herbs until it starts sticking to the bottom and then we're gonna move to the next step. So we're gonna mix this in. It is coming nicely, but I wanna add a little bit more of water in here. But before I do that, I'm gonna add a little bit of salt, about a teaspoon of salt, because I already add some salt to the duck meat when I season it. So I'm just gonna add that amount and we can taste later. I'm gonna add my onion. So I'm gonna put in the onions now. And while the onion is cooking and the masala and spices are cooking up some more, I'm gonna add this little bit more water here. So all that beautiful spices can really open up before we add the duck meat to it. So let's check now on how our masala is doing. It is cooking up nicely. I'm gonna turn this. Ooh, it starts sticking, but I need a longer spoon because my hand is burning with the heat. So I'm gonna use a longer spoon. I'm gonna low down my stove because I can see it starts sticking to the bottom. And then we will come back and add the, the duck in a few minutes. So now our masala is ready for the duck. I'm gonna put everything in now. Here I 
have the duck. I season it and I clean it up overnight so it's well seasoned for 24 hours. So let's mix all that goodness into the duck. And this really, really smells good. And we're going to leave it until all the natural water or juices from the duck evaporate before I add anything else to the pot. So now we're going to check on this. And it's been cooking up nicely. I like to add potatoes to mine. So I'm going to add, I have three potatoes. I just cut them in half. I will mix them up so we can get all that nice flavor in to the potatoes i'm gonna add some water in here and i'm gonna cover this pressure cooker and leave it for 25 to 30 minutes or until the meat is nice and soft and we will show you when this is finished but before i go let me add my water now i have warm water that I am adding because I don't want to slow up the cooking process. I have this other spoon here that I started out with first. Okay, so just a little bit of water to cover the meat because we're eating this with dal, so we don't need too much gravy in here. So now I'm gonna cover the pot and we'll come back in 30 minutes. So here is my beautiful duck curry requested by the birthday boy for his dinner. We didn't have duck for about two years now. And we are very excited to have this curry tonight. I have my doll here and some rice. I'm gonna serve him up a plate and let him give the review of this dinner. To all my duck curry fans, hope you guys like this video. If you do, please give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, please consider subscribing. And all the other fans, please come on down and let's have some birthday dinner. So now our birthday boy is going to try his dinner that he requested. His beautiful doll and rice and duck curry with potato. So Matthew, if you wanna dig in, tonight you're gonna give our viewers the review how the food tastes. Yeah. Okay, so taste. So take some of the duck and a smaller piece. And then I'll take some of the rice and dal right here, mm -hmm. rice and dal. Okay. And I'll taste this for you guys. It's really, really good. Yeah. I really love the duck. Mm -hmm. And yeah, it tastes really good with doll. And yeah. Okay, so you hope you enjoy it. Enjoy your dinner. After you finish with your dinner, we're going to do the cake, okay? Yeah. Enjoy.
Matthew, come. Come over here. We're gonna sing happy birthday for you. Look at your cake. It looks really nice. You know what you get? Uh, it looks like Oreo, Oreo cake. Oreo ice, ice cream. cream. Okay. Yeah. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Matthew. Happy birthday to you. May the good Lord bless you. Cha cha cha. May the good Lord bless you. Cha cha cha. Lord, may the good Lord, may the good Lord bless you. Okay, think about your wish and blow your candle. now because it's ice cream and it was in the freezer we're gonna try to warm up our knife okay so we're getting Matthew his piece of ice cream cake and we're gonna feed him before everybody take their piece so let mommy give Matthew first thank you Nat yeah mm. where's the spoon here Okay. Kind of hard to... So it's very cold, so I'm gonna take a little tiny piece. Happy birthday, babe. Thank you. You wanna go next? You have cake here. You get caught with the cake. A little bit because it's freezing. Thank you. Let Jesse give him. Let Jess. It's really hard, so you have to be careful. Happy birthday. Thanks. I'm gonna get a piece and give it to Okay, you gotta bend. Get to. Bend, come closer to the cake table so Dad can give you. Happy birthday, Matthew. Thanks. I still feel you have to talk to me. <laughs> so, Matthew, I always have my speech to say before I cut the rest of the cake. In the meantime, it's gonna get a little bit softer. I wanna say that I'm so blessed to have you, my firstborn. My one and only son, I just want you to know how much we love, adore, and care for you. You're an amazing child, so smart and so helpful, easy to talk to, and there's not enough word to explain Matthew. We have such a good relationship since the day he was born. He was always close to mommy until now. We always have our mom and son moment and I really do enjoy every moment, every stage of your life. And we're blessed to have you. So I wanna say, we love you so much. Mwah. Love you, babe. Hope you had a good birthday. Okay, if Natalie, would you like to wish Matthew something? Yeah. Okay, you can come over here. Um, I hope you enjoy your birthday. Um, Happy birthday, and I love you. Aww. Thanks. Okay, so Natalie, did you, Jessica, how about you? Uh, happy birthday, and I hope you had a good day. Give him a hug. Okay, Dad, now you can have your cakes on. Thank you. Enjoy. Happy birthday, Matthew. I hope you enjoy the curry and the cake, your ice cream cake. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna cut the rest and we're gonna sit down. It's a, like kind of a hot day today and enjoy a piece of this ice cream cake. And I wanna thank you guys for spending this board day with us, staying with us from breakfast, lunch, and dinner. We, because of the time we're going through, we can only celebrate with our immediate family, but thank God that we have you guys to celebrate with us as well so if you like this video please give us a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed yet to my channel i hope you consider subscribing soon until then we want to say to you guys stay safe stay blessed bye for now, bye for now.